Hello, welcome to Tazonomi Online Mathematics. Uh, in this video, you want to provide an answer to a question under menstruation one, a segment to be precise. So in a diagram, M and N are the centers of an equal red eye of seven centimeter. The circles intercept at a point of P and Q. So if the angle produced at the center are all equal to 60 degrees, we have to calculate correct to the nearest whole number, the area shaded in this diagram. So this is a two circle. So with this, you can see that if I have this circle, without them being intersecting, drawing the center, I believe you can see that this is exactly what the circle look like before bringing them closer. So as you bring them closer, this area, these two area came to elapse. If you bring them closer to touch, this area is going to slide onto this and overlap it. It is going to overlap in order to form the diagram we are seeing. So we can see that it is this, which is a sector sliding over the, the cord. It slides over to form this. So if I shade the, the sector, uh, the segment of this sector A and B, if I want to shade the segment of sector A, So if these two circles overlap, you can see that it is their sec segment that form the shaded portion. If I find the area of the segment in sector B, the answer will be the same as the area of the segment in sector what? Uh, segment B, A. Why? Because they have the same radius of 7, 7. They have the same angle subtended at the center at 60 degrees each. So what I need to do is to find the area of segment B plus the area of segment what, A and add it together. Or I can go a short way by finding the area of one of them, the segment, then multiply by two. You first have to find the area of the sector, the complete sector which we know is given as theta over 360 times pi r squared and theta is given as 60 degrees pi is 22 on 7 the radius is what? 7 times 7 7, 7 will give us centimeter squared so per our calculation this will cancel this this will go here, we have what? 1 over 6 and 11, 3. So it's going to be 77 divided by 3. And that will give us 25.67 centimeter square. For the area of the sector, if I find of the other one, I'll get the same answer. So the next thing is to find the area of the triangle formed at the center. So area, we know the area of uh, uh, the triangle formed at the center having uh, the same radius is going to be given as half r squared times what? Sine theta. So in this case, we have 1 over 2 times 7 times what? our sine Theta, which is what? 60. We know that if you multiply 7 by 7, you get 49 divided by 2. Multiplying sine 60, which is root 3 over 2. And if you do that calculation, you also get what you have as 21.2 centimeters square as being the area of the 
triangle. You know that we are looking for the area of the segment. So we know area of a segment equals to area of a sector minus area of fold of the triangle. So first of all, we have the area of the, the sector. We have the area of our triangle. So now we can subtract to get the value of the area of the sector. So from this, our area of segment is going to be area of the sector which we have as 25.67 minus that of the triangle. So you can see that in this diagram, if we draw a line, straight line, that line is going to be the chord. So this is the area that we found. But the answer here will be similar to the area of the other side. So you only multiply by two. So the area of the segment of the two equals circle is going to be 2 times 4.5 centimeter square. And that will give us our 8.90 centimeter square. So this is what we are going to get. But the question demand for the answer to be in the nearest whole number. So for the nearest whole number, our answer will be 9 centimeter square per our calculation. So you can see that this is just an overlap of what? Two circles where the two segments overlap. Since they are the same uh, circles, they have the same segment. So the two give us nine centimeters at the shaded region. Thank you for watching. I believe you have learned a thing or two. Feel free to share the video, like, and leave a comment for us to get interactive. Thank you.